Welcome to the latest headlines from the Times and Star and Whitehaven News. Workington MP Tony Cunningham is demanding answers from the bosses of a Workington care home, which is accused of putting patients at risk. It was revealed last week that Stylecroft Residential Home could be closed down by the Commission for Social Care Inspection because of problems with its handling of medication and record-keeping. Mr Cunningham, who met with worried relatives of a Stylecroft resident, said he was deeply concerned and would write to the home's chief executive. Meanwhile, Cumbria County Council has suspended admitting its clients for the time being. Independent inspectors found records at the privately run home were so bad that some patients were at risk of being given double doses. Housing Minister Margaret Beckett is due to visit Keswick this afternoon to see a major new housing estate in the town. Derwent and Solway Housing Association is investing £15 million into three housing estates in the town, providing 129 homes. Netherfield, Derwent Close and Greeter Court will provide affordable housing for people in the town. Ms Beckett will also visit St Herbert's School, where pupils took part in a naming competition for Netherfield. A raffle to sell a house in Cleeta has failed. Sue Wickwar hoped to sell her £95,000 house on Kilnbrow by raffle, but has only sold 700 tickets and raised £2,000. The competition closes at midnight on Saturday, and a draw for a cash prize instead of the house will be held in April. 2% of the profits will go to the Great North Air Ambulance. Her website attracted 30,000 hits, but Sue said she thought she had been affected by the credit crunch. She will now put the house back on the market. Whitehaven's Mount Pleasant area will be transformed. Copeland Council and Westlake Renaissance have £433,000 of investment to regenerate the area from the harbour up towards the Hague Mining Museum. The improvements will include spaces for outdoor art activities, new lights and signs. Proposals from architects Gillespie's are on show at the Beacon until mid-April. Log on to the Times and Star on Whitehaven News online for the latest news, views, videos and sport.